Tofacitinib is an oral agent taken twice daily, used to treat many rheumatological conditions, mainly rheumatoid arthritis. Tofacitinib inhibits Janus kinase signaling. Janus kinase is abbreviated JAK. Immune cells such as macrophages, monocytes, and T cells play a key role in the pathophysiology of uh, rheumatic diseases such as rheumatoid arthritis. In rheumatological diseases, JAK STAT signaling pathway is very important in the production of inflammatory proteins. A normal JAK STAT pathway involves a cytokine or a ligand binding onto a receptor. JAK is recruited intracellularly and activates a number of phosphorylation events. Activated JAK then phosphorylates the intracellular domain of the receptor first. Stat proteins dock and become phosphorylated by JAK. The stat proteins form a dimer and move to the cell nucleus. The stats is a transcription factor which essentially activates pro-inflammatory cytokine genes. And by activating pro-inflammatory cytokine genes, it essentially makes pro-inflammatory cytokines the end product. And these cytokines play a key role in rheumatological diseases such as rheumatoid arthritis. Tofacitinib is a Janus kinase inhibitor, a JAK inhibitor. It inhibits the phosphorylation of JAK, which means that essentially inhibits the JAK and STAT phosphorylation pathway. Inhibition of the JAK-STAT pathway means reduced pro-inflammatory cytokine production and so a reduced inflammatory response in joints and other tissues. Adverse effects of tofacitinib include hyperlipidemia, hepatotoxicity, and leukopenia, increasing the risk of infections. It's also been associated with lymphoma. All patients should be tested for tuberculosis before starting on tofacitinib. Patients should also be screened for hepatitis B and C prior to starting tofacitinib, since this medication may increase the risk of reactivation of these infections. There's further risk of herpes zoster uh, in patients using kinase inhibitors.